Okay, so I keep seeing videos going around about how having low LDL is associated with worse outcomes. And a lot of people are sort of extrapolating that and saying it's a good thing to have high LDL. Now, I'm not saying it's good or bad. All I'm saying is, is it looks bad as a community when people continuously post these things that, oh, look, people who have low LDL are doing worse than people with high LDL. That's probably due to reverse causation. In other words, inflammation, as well as cancer, drives down LDL. Hence why people with low LDL typically have worse outcomes, and hence why you see all these associative studies showing that people with very low LDL have worse or higher increases of mortality, cardiovascular disease, non-cardiovascular death, etc. Because interleukin-6 increases LDL receptors and drops LDL. So inflammation decreases LDL, cancer decreases LDL. So, and regardless, these are associative studies. So I'm not, I'm not here to say that having high LDL is good or bad or having low LDL is good or bad, but we shouldn't be using associative studies to suggest that it's good to have high LDL because people with low LDL are at a worse or higher risk of death. It's likely due to reverse causation. That is likely due to the fact that inflammation and cancer drive down LDL and probably has nothing to do with the fact that people with low LDL, it's that that lower amount of LDL is actually increasing their risk. Now it may be, but you would have to try to adjust, which is always impossible to do, all the inflammatory markers, um, how do you even figure out if someone has cancer or not, um, in, the, in that type of study, right, to adjust for that. So again, these are associative studies. We shouldn't be using them to say, look, having high LDL is a good thing.